Howdy folks, welcome to episode 33. Today we're going to break through the barrier. So I brought up all the mining ships, if you recall. Well, let's go back to our map as usual. So here's the center, and remember uh, we were mining down in this area. We had those ships going back and forth from these two sectors. And the mining carrier is still back and forth over here, which is fine. Remember we came up here, and we've set up our area here. That's our home space. And so I brought up all these ships, and I am sitting in Mini Scout right now. And we've got all the mining ships up here, as you can see, and each of them have a free slot. And I also have Raptor and Lady. We're going to tell them to escort me. There we go. We're going to escort Mini Scout. All right. So they're going to all come in here, and what we're going to do is we're going to go up to this one right here. So we're going to go up to this and I believe all of our ships should have the ability, yeah, all of our ships have the ability to make it there, as you can see. So everybody in this sector is set. Oh, this one isn't. Um, I don't think we need that many. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, we need one, one or two more. Okay, so let's set this one to escort me, mini scout. There we go. Okay, so all of us are going to go up to here. And up here is the gateway. So that's what we did in 32 and a half was we went and we we found a couple more uh, asteroid mines like here. And, you know, other than that, we basically just, you know, went around to some more of the yellow sectors and found the gateway. So let's go down there. And I need to make sure that in my inventory I have one of these. So the energy suppressor satellite, if you remember, you can buy those from, you can buy the energy suppressor satellite from the, uh, uh, what are they called? The equipment docks and the, um, the traveling equipment salesman. So this is it. We're going to, we're going to set that off right now. We're going to use that. There we go. All right. So now nobody should be warping in here. What is that? Oh, that's, that's, that's the energy signature suppressor. Okay, cool. That's cool. That's a neat little model. I like that. It reminds me of the Mad Station because it's so tiny. Because it's like some giant station that's been shrunk down to a little baby size. Okay, so this is the sector. These are all of the thingies. And let's go to F9 screen so you can see. So here's all of the asteroids. And each one of them has its own uh, number on it. And so what you do is like here. This one is number four. So we need to park a ship here. They should all be escorting me. You need to park a ship here with number four in it, with the purple Zotan artifact, number four. And I think it has to be within a kilometer or something. Oh, cool, my shadow going across it. I like that. Let's see what, we'll see what we get here. See when their shadows go across it. Come on, Raptor. I still, like, I still like watching this ship from the outside. It looks so cool. All right, let's see if we can get it to... Because that was pretty neat. No, it's not going to do it. Okay. So we're going to take one of these ships, we're going to go to <clears throat> this one here. Sure, why not, right? And actually, we can take the ones with the numbers in them. Why don't we do that? Why don't we go by numbers, okay? We're going to take number four. We're going to enter ship. And number four is going to go up to asteroid number four, right? There we go. So this is number four. These guys are like, they're like cats at the food bin or whatever. <laughs> I'm going to nose you out. Oh, there there we go. See, I think maybe it's your own, only your own ship that casts shadows. It's possible. Okay, so we're up here. We need to put in number four into our systems. So let's go. Um, yeah, it's, what did they say? X, XS, whoops, XSTN. Okay, so we have number seven. I need to get the other ones out of my um, I need to get the other ones out of my alliance inventory, apparently. So let's go like this. We're going to go number seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. There we go. Mission accomplished. Operation Exodus. Okay, that's interesting. Now that I put them all into our thing. Do I have, do I have the other one? The other one is in one of my ships, I think. I think it is. Okay, so number four. We're going to go like this. We're going to put number four in here. And, and what we're going to watch here is there should be somewhere on this, 
there should be like a, an indicator that shows that it's um, that it's activated. So watch, we're gonna go like this. We're gonna put number four in here. Number four. There we go. See, it's right there. Okay, so that's when we take that out. Can we can we remove it? I can't remove it. Remove. See, when we take it out, that light goes back off. So we're gonna put number four in here. Cool. We don't have to install permanently either. All right, because we're not we're not doing that to get the uh, the benefits out of it. Okay, so then we're gonna go to um, back to this ship here, right? And we're gonna go to number three. Let's go over to number three. I need to find which ship has number one in it. So, because I think that's the only one that we ha we're gonna have to deal with as far as that goes. So we're gonna go like this, and we're gonna go to each one of these. Number three, so I don't have a number three, so we're just gonna do that with Mini Scout. That's fine, I think. Yeah, because we can take out the trading system. We're gonna put in number three. There we go, see that one's on. Now we're gonna go to ship number four. And we're gonna go to, let me check Raptor. Let me do this first. Enter ship. Let's go like this, number. We have number eight and number three. Okay, so we can do number eight in this one. So where is eight? That's gonna be one, so that's gonna be eight. Yep, okay, so we'll take Raptor over here. We'll get this going. There we go. So now the nice thing is, like I said, that, that energy suppressor is gonna be a huge help because we don't have to deal with, you know, bad guys coming in and attacking us in the middle of this and everything. So it's, it's worth the peace of mind. <laughs> All right, so that one's on. Then we're gonna go to Lady and we'll see what Lady has in her. See what lady has, number three. Where is number one? Oh, there's number one, okay. Seven, one, two, five, six, seven. Okay, apparently. All right, so number three, everybody's got number three, don't they? That's number three, all right. So we're gonna take, um, where's number four? Right there, nope. Number seven. <laughs> Where's four? <laughs> right? Here, let's go like this. Enter ship. Where's number four? Number four is gonna do number four. Okay, we've got that one already. So what am I doing? I need to go to two then, right? And we're gonna put number two in here. Watch out for number one and don't step in number two. And we're gonna go over to here. There we go. Remember, these guys do not have any strafe at all. They've only got forward and backward. So, and, and whatchamacallit's iron thingies. So we're gonna put number two in this one. There we go, we're gonna take out, you know what, I gotta be careful with that. Let me see. How much, uh, how much energy do we have? 11, 21. What happens if we take this out? Because we're gonna put number two in there and it's not gonna take anything, okay. Are we gonna have enough? Energy, yeah, we're fine as far as that goes. We can even turn off the shields for right now. I knew, I'm, I know I'm gonna forget to turn those back on and then the ship's gonna get blown up, right? Number two, all right, so that one's activated and then we're gonna go to number one. It's gonna be this one. All right, where is number one? Over here, cool. Get going here and we'll coast in. Number one. All right, that should activate in a second here. This one doesn't even have a reconstruction token. Is this one that got blown up or something? There we go, okay, see it's within like 1.2 or something like that. All right, we're gonna go like this and we're gonna do ship number seven. We swap to number seven. <laughs> it's sitting right up against them, all right. That's gonna be over here, right? Seven. And it looks like my corn farm is finally selling stuff. Good. All right, there's number seven. 
we had i went over to the corn farm and it was like it was not doing stuff the way it should and everything so i'm hoping that uh that the other ones the mines that we set up aren't going to do that too okay so we're going to do this make sure that come on make sure that it's stopped there we go all right much better all right, and then we're going to do, um, I think we've only got one left, right? Number six? Or do we have number six and number five? That's seven. It's going to do this to me again. Enter number six. There we go. All right. Number six. Be right over there. There we go. Yeah, there's something, there's some bug in this, because when I hit something on F, on this, half the time it'll deselect it. So I'm not sure what's that, what's going on with that. Number six. There we go. I'm glad that you don't have to permanently install it. We don't have to come back to equipment docks to deal with that. But we did have to take out mining systems out of several of these ships. We're going to have to basically re, um, redo all of our mining ships now that we're going across the barrier. We're going to have to make sure that they can mine, which ones can mine organite and that kind of thing. Okay, so that one's done. And then we've got number four five right okay so we've got lady adventurous here see it did this again i just selected oh it didn't okay never mind i, I knew that Shh, don't tell anybody <laughs> all right there's number five does lady have a lady does not have a free slot that she can put stuff in does she nope okay so we're gonna do number seven is all the way over there one is over here, right? One is at one. Two is at two. Four. I'm, I think I'm going to have to take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, lady doesn't have an empty slot, so I'm going to have to take her back to the... Uh, <laughs> duh, right? Or I can put some giant computer. Let me just put a giant computer thing on her. What do we need to... What do we need to... Uh, 43k okay let's go into the build screen let's do computer um how much energy do we have yeah we've got energy okay so we're gonna do computer core right and we need how much processing power 31 we need like 12 okay so let's go like this and go like this and how much is that plus a thousand how about that? Plus 19,000. I think that's a little excessive. There we go. One more. How about that? All right. Do we have enough energy? We have enough energy. All right, cool. So let's go to number... Which one was that? This one here. It's the one that's, that's not showing. All right, and we should be able to put... Yep, we should be able to put number five in this slot, and that should open the gate. Let's do it. So we can take that one back out and remove the the um, the processing from this. There we go. There's the gate. Now I think I think we're fine once we even um, once we just sit here. I think we're totally fine. Okay. So we can select all of these ships on the map. There we go. We can tell them to stop and do nothing, right? So here come all of the Zotan. They're just going to come out of the barrier. They're going to come flying out of the barrier and just kind of wander off and stuff. Cool. All right, so that's that. Now we should be able to, I think, once we take these out, see, the wormhole is going to stay open. Okay. So, yep, they don't need to be in there anymore, so we can take all this stuff out. We can take this off of here. There we go. Right? Did it did it do it? Yeah, it just needs to recalculate the the geometry for the ship. Cool. Look at all these ships. Hmm. Yeah, there's gonna be a ton of Zotan now in the in the thing. And then if we look on the map, yeah, see there's a little there's the wormhole goes through there. So we could take Lady through the wormhole because she's got I think she's got the biggest shields and everything like that. We could probably go through there. So let's try that and I think what we're going to do too is we're going to take all of these ships we're going to take these ships 
and we're going to you know what we have the energy suppressor in here so we'll leave them I think we'll leave them here we're gonna leave those ships in here because we can take the Zotan artifacts back out of them and do all that stuff in here instead of doing it in the other sector where we may or may not get attacked by pirates and stuff let's go through here and we'll see what we can do see what we can find you know what I need to do too <clears throat> I probably should bring Raptor with um, TF orders escort there we go we'll have we'll have Raptor come with me because I want to I want to check out the um, the economy and stuff like that too because Raptor has the trading stuff on the other side of the barrier you know what I mean Raptor has the trading thing so I want to check out check that out too so we'll go through the wormhole and we'll see what happens that's pretty cool alright so what do we got is it just an empty sector it's just an empty sector cool so let's try yeah we should Ooh, what is that right there there's meow the cat adventurer let's interact greet that's it really that was weird wasn't it greet huh I'm wondering if Meow will greet us in a second. Okay, so we're going to check out, we're going to mark some of these. Whoops, tag sector, tag sector. We're going to tag a couple of these, and then we can go to a few of these and see what they have in them. Couple of these, couple of these. Come on. There we go. Apparently Mew made it to the center, too. I wonder how many licks it took Mew to make it to the center. <laughs> All right, there we go. We're gonna do that. Cause see, I don't think Lady has the deep scan like which which call it does. Still nothing. Yeah. All right. Well, maybe we'll catch you on the way back, Mew. <laughs> uh, no idea. It's funny because I can't remove that fighter group because I don't have hangers. <laughs> uh, funny stuff. All right, overcome the barrier. There we go. Enter. Answer. You did it. We did it. Now we'll find Ivorian and get rich. Yeah, I'm the best. <laughs> ah, this is so amazing. Good luck on your search. You too. All right, cool. Who are these guys? Let's see on the map. Are they friendly? Are they... Really? The Kumam have... Okay, that is funny. That is really funny. So the guys we were allies with are here, and they're they own this sector. Is that that's funny? So they've got a trading post and everything all over here. So how is it that <laughs> how is it that we couldn't get across? Right? They got across the barrier, and and they wouldn't tell us about it, even though we're allies. All right. So we can check out um, we can check out some more of these, I guess. Let me see. Can we talk to them? We can't talk to them. What about that ship there? That ship there? The cruisers? We can't talk to those cruisers, apparently. There's another cruiser. Nope, those are all cruisers. Okay, is that a trader up there? I mean, we can... Yeah, here. Let's see. Um, Where's your home sector? Come on, Prime. Huh. Okay. And let's see if he says, is there anything interesting around here? Always possible. Uh, okay. Yeah. No. We're not going to do that in this episode. Okay. So we're going to... Um, now that we've gotten across the barrier, is there... Is there... Uh, see, there's... Xanion. We need to find some uh, Ogonite and stuff like that, too, and Avorion. So that's going to be our next thing. And i got to get the... Um, we're not going to do it in this episode. We're th we'll do that in the bonus episode. But I want to get the thing set up. Um, so the other thing I wanted to do was, before we're done here, I wanted to go over to our mine, aluminum mine, and these, let me see, we can switch to, whoops, switch to sector, there we go, we're going to go to the first one, and we're going to, um, we're going to hopefully not get attacked, right? We'll do this while we're setting it up. And then we'll bring the ships to do it later. But I'll do this because I'm lazy. Because it's only 100000 So I sold a bunch of titanium and neonite. $10 million to one and $20 million to the other. So we have like 200 something million 
credits right now too, FYI. Let's go like this and um, this use. There we go. You can't activate from, okay, so fine. That's, that's fine. Just move it there and now activate it, please, before bad guys show up. Thank you. Can we do it? Nice. Okay, so now we have an energy suppressor. We don't have to worry about bad guys showing up in order to um, to mess with us. So if you look at this, this is the mine that we found. We did an asteroid. Remember, we did the asteroid claim and everything. So if we go like this. Nope, if we go into here, that's what it is. The trade goods factor appears to be working as intended. It was telling me that it wasn't working because it had didn't have cargo space. It doesn't require ingredients. Our profit is zero. Okay. So is it, um, I think we can actively sell goods as I think what we need to do. And so we'll go to our other factory. Maybe it's the other one. I don't know. Let me check. But I went, when I set these up, it told me that, um, it told me that they uh, couldn't produce anything because there wasn't any cargo space. It appears to be working as intended. Okay. I have no idea then. It says it's producing. So where is our... See, we don't have any cargo bay. So how are we producing aluminum? I'm not sure that it is. I'm not sure that it is. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into build mode. And I downloaded um, from the workshop. I got one from Zem, which is Shrike uh, Gaming. If you watch his... He's got some cool... Um, He's got some cool uh, Ovorion videos and everything, too. I've been watching a bunch of his. So uh, we'll go to the workshop. And so I downloaded a couple. This, these look really cool, but they're, like, expensive and huge. So there's, <laughs> yeah, see, they're really expensive and huge and everything. I mean, they look, this is what I want to do eventually, too. But for right now, just as, like, a placeholder and stuff, we're going to put in this one. And we're going to apply this design. So see, it's only going to cost us a little bit. We're going to apply this design. And see, there we go. Now that we've got the docking ports too. Because the other thing didn't have any docking ports. I don't know how anybody's going to dock on this thing without it. And the other thing we need to do is we need to do, we need to get some crew going. So we need mechanics and sergeants and all that stuff. So we're going to have to get the other one. Where is it? See, now we gained 20 aluminum. Okay, now it's actually working. Let's go like this and go into our cargo. See, now we're making awesome. All right, so let's switch to the other one. And we're going to need to do the same thing. And then we're going to need to come back with a ship that has a bunch of people on it. So we're going to go into build mode. Build mode. F9, build mode. There we go. All right, and then we're going to do the same thing. We're going to apply this. All right, and then in the thing, we need how many people? So we basically need 12, 24. We need 24 people. Okay, let's go back to the map. And we're going to bring Raptor back here. Let's switch to Craft and Sector. Let's switch to Lady first, and we'll see who has who has the, um, the crew. Because we should be able to just bring a bunch of crew over and do that. We can probably even hire some if we don't have. What do we have? We, yeah, we have 116 crew. Okay. All right. And and uh, Raptor is already set to um, to accompany me. So let's. And actually, we can just leave Raptor here. Why don't we do that? We're gonna stop here. There we go. Is it doing it? Okay. Yep. We're gonna go here. Whoops. We're gonna go here. <laughs> like that and we'll go back there and uh yeah get the get the crew on there so let me let me warp my way back there it's just going to take a couple jumps and i'll meet you back there with the uh with the crew all right we're back and by the way i will leave a link in the description to zem's workshop where he has where he has this basic mine it's got some cargo space in it and stuff like that. It's it's nice little starter, and you can add in stuff. Like he's got this little chunk taken out of it on the side so that you can add stuff in um, if you need to. You know, like you can put your headquarters and all that stuff on there. 
but yeah, that's pretty cool. So let's go like this. We should be able to interact. We should be able to transfer cargo crew. And let's go uh, 20, what was it, 12? You're too far away, really? I thought, um, I thought we didn't have to dock with this. Let me see, let me check. What do we have for systems on this? We have a transporter? Oh, uh, I guess we don't have a transporter on this thing, do we? No, because we never dock with this thing. That's why. Okay. All right, that's fine. Not a big deal. And we'll go like this. We'll transfer 12 generic crew, crew members. There we go. And we can um, go like this. And we can do 11 and 1. There we go. So now we are accrued. We have all that stuff. We have aluminum. Nice. And can go back to Lady, and we're going to do the same thing on the other one. So yeah, but anyway, that's that's cool. I'm not going to bore you guys with the details of getting all these set up, but we do have some other mines on the map. And if you look in here, under your fleet, your mines will show up there. So we have the coal mine. So. Yep, we have the coal mine, and I'm going to get some more of those set up and everything. I'm going to get some more of those set up and get, basically, because it's just like free money coming in all the time. It's passive income. Because like I said, we do want to become billionaires. <laughs> we do want to become billionaires uh, at some point in the game. But anyway, that's going to be it for episode 33. Join me in episode 34. We're going to see if we can find some Avorion. I'm going to try to get to, um, in here, I'm going to find some... Uh, turret factories and we're going to make some turrets that are capable of mining of Orion or at least Oganite. So yeah, join me in episode 34 and we'll see you then. Later.